We have engaged, for example, local suppliers, I mean, these MSMEs who supply goods and services to uh, local governments. And one of the reasons they have, issues they have realized, they have made us realize is that uh, there is always, uh, I don't want to use the word corruption, but there is always uh, someone somewhere who wants to always first get something out of a deal and they had rather delay uh, the procurement process until they you know, until they uh, get something out of it. So I agree, that is a change that we have inefficiencies when it comes to execution, but also in terms of monitoring. He revealed that over the years, there has been a 5% increase in unabsorbed monies returned to the consolidated fund. All in all, it brings the aspect that one, as government, uh, we are not efficiently working, government is not efficiently working in ensuring that it delivers on the set priorities as per the timelines, but also it shows a challenge of a policy when it comes to procurement policies that is not working and which needs to be revised because this trend of underutilized funds has always been, you know, it has been on the rise actually. Kiza says this means government is not efficiently working to deliver priorities. You are having money. But in, you return back money to the Treasury, okay? But out of the money returned, 56.8% of it is non-wage. It means that you've been paid to do a job, but you did not fulfill that job. So why? It shows that somewhere then you are not delivering.